Uh, hey guys, look what's going to I want to... What? Then we be playing uh, the Coffin of Andy and Lele. I did not expect it to be this. Then I said the Steam thingy to be... The... Okay, sorry. Anyway, so I just want to real quickly have a chat with you guys about... Why does this not work? I just really want to have a chat with you guys about... Um... Yeah, let me mute this. I want to have a chat with you guys about um, Mutual Company. Basically, uh, go see the post if you want full details. But um, basically, uh, Lethal Company is way too difficult. Every time I've seen someone play with the company, it was always in a multiplayer. I can't play with other people because they're too unpredictable. You know, someone might be very, very, like, bad person. Um, so I decided to scrap that game until, unless, like, it's made easier. Because, like, I would literally do something, die, and then have to restart. And there's, like, no way. Because, like, you have to have someone monitor. You have to have someone go with you. you have to, and I can't do all that alone. So I decided to, uh, ask, to ask for a refund. And, yeah, I won't be playing with the company. Now, of course, I don't have to pay every single game. I just was curious because it looked good. And a lot of people were liking it. It had very good reviews. And I was like, hey, what is this? But I guess it's way too difficult for me to play. So I won't be playing with the company. I'm sorry. Just wanted to have a little talk with you. So, uh, yeah, unless, like, they make the difficulty easier, or whoever made the game. Okay, anyway, but, yeah, I made, I, not made, I'm an idiot. I downloaded this game, and, uh, what the move, uh, interact, space, menu, or cancel menu, shift, page down, or F, full screen. Episode 1, the coffin, makes sense? So, what happens? Lele, I, I don't want to. Well, I do. Just go over and... What? Kick to the... You? What? I thought she's your friend. Mom said you'd help him with anything. Well, get in trouble. Look the hell up. Where are we? No. Good morning, Ashley. Ugh. As much as you love feeling sorry for yourself, it's time for a little inter interlude. And this time to find out nutrients and not die. It's ready, set, go. Uh, what am I doing? Kitchen. This on the cabinet is nothing. Nice. You used to fill your stomach with water. But it's not enough. You better do my sustenance. Hmm. John cannot pay bills. They cannot be eaten. Find don't want budge. You've been locked in here for months now. So what happened? Parents are fucked on this bed. Nice. Burn it. You mean you also mean slept, right? I'm just saying this is where your older brother Paul church. <laughs> if it's kind of short turns it's truly an hour exhausted as food. But wait, what is that? Oh! Amazing, you should you should share this to your brother. It should turn anything to your brother. Damn damn it, don't be so greedy all the time. Jeez, calm down with that. Now loading. Hey! Who are you? Show him the tomato can. Ta da Oh, Andrew. Not the reaction you were hoping for. Ahem. Ta-da! We're not eating that, huh? No, that's the very last thing we have, Ashley. I think we should hold on to it a little longer. That, that's not how sustenance works. Quit your complaining. You're energetic enough to go rummaging through our dress. Are you clearly not dying yet? How, how do you know it was in... Because I hid it there, away from you. <gasps> I lived in a den of snakes. I lived in a den of snakes. Ugh, don't rile me up. You're making me hungry. Don't, do you want... Do you, huh? Huh? Do you know what, okay, I can't read. Do you know what would help me, what would help with that, Andrew, my dear? Jesus Christ. No, put the tomatoes away somewhere. Put them in my mouth, I will. I can see your heart is set on this. Fine, let's eat them. Screw our futures. <laughs> Yay. Time for, oh my god, I literally cannot read. Time for you to go cook some tomatoes. Jesus Christ. Wait, I have to do- I mean, I guess I was the one that learned to eat it, so. Good day, are you still alive in there? Warden? Hello? Oh? If you want- if you won't make a sound, I'll assume you're dead. And I don't bring food for the dead. Dude, don't bring it to the living either. Ha! I'll take that as a yes, still alive. And don't blame me for the delivery guy screwing up. Can't you go- can't you go grab something from the store for us? Nah, not my job. Nah, not my job. I'll check in on you guys again later. Bye. No, wait! Wait, 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 come back! He doesn't. Damn it. Well, that's a um, skill issue, but... You boiled a canned tomato to make delicious boiled canned soup. There's even a little bit of pepper that's seasoned with this gourmet stuff right here. No salt, though. Use all of it to spike your water in order to avoid overhydrating yourself while drinking to fill your stomach. 
Uh, well, how is it? At this point, you can feed me a can of worms or whatever. Uh, that says the best thing I ever ate. Kiss ass. What? No, I'm saying that's how hungry I am. Send them with an ominous audio assault serious drums. Are you kidding me? The neighbor is at it again? Wanna take a peek? Nope. But I'll, I'll come along if you do. Here, catch. Got a balcony key? I swear, if it's something bad, I will actually uninstall this game. Okay, I'm just kidding, that's a joke, but I will be very mad. Not the balcony, that's the balcony. What's happening? Oh, it's music. Ha! Huh, can't really see who spawned from here. You want to play if you should take a leap of faith towards the neighbor's balcony. It's only the fourth floor. Actually, don't you even think about it. Ah, he's no fun. Guess you have to set something, set up something to cross. You can't cross it. That is okay. I need a couch. No, I don't. Bunch of rooms you need to do. Can you do? Uh, toilet. Is, what? What is? What is? It? Is that a TV? No way. This way, this way, this way, this way. Bed? No. What? Oh crap! Are you right? These damn DIY shelves, I swear. Gotten wooden plank. Why did you rip out the. Okay, this is just stupid. Why would you rip out a wooden plank? Set down the wooden plank. Okay, now let's cross. No, I can just do that. Boxes are full of useless junk. Oh, that's what's happening. Oh, demons from hell, hear my plea. Oh, the unholy ones, I come seeking your advice. You idiot. Damn it. What am I, what am I doing wrong? I thought that was perfect. I knew I should have killed that guy when I had the chance. A uh, bun, maybe? What do you make of that? Everyone needs a hobby, but yes. Forget this. It's, it, is it an old time they let us watch TV? Knock. Bother you're sitting there, which is a bad idea. And I actually trade there. I don't see that's wrong, but it's so good for banishing things in the net. Uh huh. I'm confused. Ah, the remote is dead. Just push the buttons on the TV. Meh, what a pain. Fine, I'll fetch some batteries for you. I always have to do everything around here. Yeah, yeah, woe is you. It is! So I saw the um, uh, Steam poster, I think it was, and I, Ashley's the younger sister. Why is she doing it? That's so stupid. Just like their hopes and dreams. They were the. You took the batteries out of the alarm clock. Got batteries. Why would you? Why do you need an alarm clock? What? I got the remote right here. No, nah, that's okay. I think I just put the buttons on the TV after all. I can see you have the batteries, just hand them over. Nope, I'm set up, hold on to them. We might need them later. But what exactly? What are being difficult about this? I'm not... Thanks for tuning in. Today we'll share with you some joyous development in regard to tainted water situation. We're happy to announce all the departments to which the tainted water has been delivered has been resecured. So it has been three months since the first incident was over and death tolls now come 53 total. No biggie. In the quarantine period for those who may are at risk of being sent by another two weeks. Again? And my friends in the quarantine, thank you for keeping and discussing pressing for the body far, far away from me. Sorry, it's it's thank you for continuing this generation to the public safety. As of for today, cheers. I'm going to bed. Oh, we've been infected with something. So I have to do the same. What the f Wait, Mom, where are you going? Me and your father will be staying out. I don't hold for a bit. I thought they said we should stay at home until I didn't I didn't drink anything. Mom. No, booze, not dirty, containing water, nothing. The only thing I've drank is some orange juice from a carton. Anyway, I'm gonna miss my bus. You and Andrew come can join us later. Later. Alright, this one hurt a bit. The nurse sticks are kneeling you. There's like a motherfucker. There we go. There we go. And now you. How long do we have to stay to have to stay home? The results from your blood work will be done tomorrow. So if you, everything is well, you're free to come and get come and go as you please after that. And if not, then you get to see what happens if not. We die or something? That's all for now. Take care. Stop calling me, Ashley, please. If you need something, ask the workers there. I can't do anything for you. What the hell? And I don't want to hear these lies about starving anymore. Why the hell would I lie about this? Oh, we're grown up. Listen, this new apartment is a bit of a picture upper, so I'm really busy. 
said, isn't Andrew there with you? What do you need me to pacify you for? You get to laze around all day doing nothing. I don't know what you, what you've got to complain about. Oh, uh, food not existing? Anyway, I've got to go. Please don't call him up. I won't answer. G goodbye, Ashley. I'm sorry. Damn. That's depressing. So, we're missing all night. You wake up as one does. Instead of ruminating upon your misery, uh, you decide to clean the house up a bit. Oh, wow. Good for you. Motivation exists. Why is there dirt over it? You got nothing to clean this with your bare hands. I mean, there's a bathroom, like, right here. Fridge? Get a mop. That's a mop, not a fridge. Oh, that's a clean gutter. There's, there's a trash bag. Eat the trash. Eat the chemicals, though. Can't you eat chemicals? Up some dirt. Dirt? Why is there dirt? All over the... Oh, hey, there's more dirt. Up some dirt. Where else is there to take care of? Here, maybe? Um, no. Clean up some books. Book. Book. Do you turn on the books of the shop now? What else could you clean? Hmm... Your mind to this in this. I mean, you can't really throw it away. So what I'm looking at is that this is kind of like a comedy-ish. It's completely empty. Is it knocked over? Uh, this just this gets more and more empty. <laughs> you need some laundry. Oh, laundry! Drinking this gets. What are you, a five-year-old? I already grabbed that plank. Nah. Why is there a freaking vine over there? And I feel like that paint of or paint or whatever the hell that is would get would be useful. Laundry, laundry. Laundry will be over here. Pick up some laundry. Laundry. Yeah. <sighs> You're cleaning. What a waste of energy. You're a waste of energy. Thanks. You guys don't overdo it. How do you Come to think of it, we do do we even have detergent left? I didn't drink any, or neither did Ashley, so yes. Andrew takes us to chat. How long has it been without food? Because if it's been two days, I mean, yeah, that's like a lot, but come on, talking? And I've been, I've gone hungry because of school, because school food is garbage, and I just choose not to eat. Yes, I would rather starve than eat school food, but it's like, it does get, it does pick, pick, puck, puck. Pick, pop, I can't speak. It does pack a punch for after like six hours. But like, I don't feel like talking, especially like, I don't feel like talking. Like they're not like seven years old where they were like, anything could kill them. You know, I think the treasure is right here. You're on the laundry. Depressed. Mood. Getting dizzy. Oh no. No. Oh God. Damn it, Ashley. I told you not to overdo it. Wow, that long it's been. Huh? Good news once again. Some of you may have heard from your loved ones. That's been the supply, supply shortage in the quarantine household. There's been supply shortages. Well, boys, are we pleased to announce that all of that has been taken care of? It has? Does it look like a meeting right now? Oh, on that note, we'd like to remind you all of you not to enter the contaminated apartments. Not, you no, know, your friends don't need anything from you. Everything's taken care of. Do you still feel the urge to help? The staff will be administering bullets directly into your brain as you think. You. Uh, staff will be administering bullets directly into your brain as I thank you. So, um, this is basically what I'm thinking. What I'm th so, this is only broadcasted to the uh, uh, infected current apartments, right? I hope that cheers up, cheers you up a bit. Moving on to our next story. A brand new art museum will be. We just back to the unconsciousness. <laughs> Yay. We should try to get the phone. Hello? Of course, what is it? The shift in the tone of his voice makes you strain your eyes. No, no, go ahead. Someone is talking on the other end of the line, but you can't make out the words. They sound more and more upset as they talk, though. Well, that's... I mean, I can't do anything about that. Or I can try talking to her, but... No. Or, I mean, or I mean, yes, but that doesn't... No, I'm not angry, I'm just... No, I... Can you let me talk? Voice on the other end must have said no. It's increasing loud, but you still can't make out all the words. Always about you don't lay in Ashley, and I've had the time to think, so this is mom. Just can't anymore. So that's it then. Now uh, it's quite on both ends. Well, alright, I guess. What else is there to say? Sorry. Although well, I really don't see why I should be accountable uh, for. What's your phone call? Ugh. Nah. 
What was it? My ex-girlfriend, apparently. Ooh, she dumped you? Why is that? Shut Yo, what do you think? How should I know? Maybe because you're a person infested with homebody that's apparently paramount quarantined? Or because she found someone new? Somebody new? It's been a few months. Few? Oh, no, it has not been a few months without them eating. It's been a few months since they've been locked in here. Maybe she just didn't like you in the first, that much in the first place? Whatever you say, Ashley. There might have been something more ta tactful to say. Yeah, whatever. You pretend to sleep until you really fall asleep again. Now you've been out for who knows how long. I feel you should check on your brother. Don't tell me you committed suicide. He's not here. Is the laundry done? No. I mean, maybe. What is it? To, what is he doing? Where's... Did he leave? No way. We're being quarantined. How the hell would he leave? Oh, maybe he's at the balcony, question mark? There you are. Some Someone from your apartment is getting hauled into an ambulance. Hey, me too! Feel yelling for the windows and balconies. I need some help too! Please, please, I'm starving! Soon the ambulance leaves in a hurry. Jesus. Calling me surprised. I actually got that person some help. Figured they just let her die. Maybe she did die. She wasn't moving. As if they'd have their sirens blaring for a corpse. Then what do you suppose was her emergency? No idea. Nobody showed up when you fainted. Well, did you call for anyone? What do you think, dumbass? Ugh, I don't know. Maybe she went into labor. Yeah, maybe. I think they'd bring me food if I got pr Nope. Let me finish. How would you even get pregnant in here? Well, we do have that one charming fellow right next door. Over my dead body. He's in a little office rocker, so who knows? It might just end you. Forget this. Why over... Oh, protective. What? Well, excuse the hell out of me for, uh, for exploring my options here. I can't break, help, I can't read anymore. I, Jesus Christ, hold up. No! I left. Well, nothing really that happened, just sirens. Hold up. Um, let me just end the recording. I'll be back in five minutes. Sorry about that. I left the audio off. Okay, anyway. Well, excuse the hell out of me for exploring my options here. That woman didn't look pregnant anyway. Whatever, we'll just start. Jack ass. You have to go after Andrew and tell him that it ain't none of his damn business anyway. But you're just too exhausted. <laughs> but after sleeping for a few hours, only a few days, who knows, you're fully re realized and bursting with energy. Now, I don't think that's no, I'm slow. I can't control myself. And there we go. Oh, you silly lazy bones. What day is it? How long have you been locked in your bunk now? When, where the hell does Andrew get the energy to make so much noise? No, something else is knocking. He has to unscrew the lock and it's intending to lock the, the door in. Or, or out, depending on your perspective. Uh, in. Wait, no, out. How many more times are you gonna try, are you going to try that? It's gonna be barred from the other side somehow. What else am I supposed to do? Oh, God. Don't stop banging on the door, I won't bring you any food tonight. You won't know either way. Says you, the delivery will be here in a matter of hours. But I guess you don't want anything. Yeah, that's right. Now you better stop bang, bang, banging on the door, or next, or next it'll be me banging your hand against the wall. I mean, what's this video? Wait, what? What's up with this abusive thingy? Do you think that they'll delivery get that delivery today? Like I don't, I didn't fuck this up for us, did I? Unlikely. No, I guess we'll see. And see, you did. That's actually nothing was delivered. Talk about something? I got nothing. Try. There was one so Paris. It's been a few months. Are you feeling anything? Hunger? You think that someone would be happening to us right now? I think something would be happening to us by now. It's an experiment, but I haven't noticed anything. Maybe from your perspective. Maybe you look like zombies. I don't know. That nurse can never came back either. So don't you want to monitor us? Ugh, who cares? Me, Ashley, I care. Well, I don't care, nor care that you care. Aside from the starving, it sounds so bad here. Come again? Aside from starving, I like it here. Well, I don't. I want to jump off the back. Ooh, I'll race ya. <laughs> no, seriously, let's go. Let's not, though I appreciate your eagerness to join me. But it's a bit too romantic, so I'll pass that. Mm, I don't like that. Excuse me? What? You don't see it? Just imagine hitting the ground together, and with this touch force of body turning to a pile of glory mush, never to be separated. Our remains will get so tangled up, we'll have to bury us together in the same coffin. 
Might as well. We can combine together and cough in front of both because they're gonna turn at you, right? I'm not jumping off the balcony with you. Get your head checked. I should get my head checked? And no wonder your girlfriend told you. Those are your plans for romance. Exactly! Not romance. I said romantic. They're not the same thing. Romantic just means something is. Amber says blast. Again, I wish he just. Oh. Well, crap. I feel like you should check that out. I found that. Uh, maybe you should, like, remove that damn blank, no? My lord, you come! And you're, uh, a little smaller than I had. I, I love it! Better than I imagined! That's what I meant. What do you offer, human? Oh, um, I don't have much to give you right now, but if you help me out, get me out of here, I can give you anything you wish. Is that no good? As you wish, human. My lord, thank you, thank you, Irish. Yeah. That means how the vision will come through the heaven. Uh, he's, yeah, by the time you're in the church, he's vanished. On the ground, lay the left body of the corpus. <laughs> They're all so shook. So, uh, am I or delirious or did you see that too? Do we have to, damn it? Well, at least, uh, very least, I want to try not to see the. That's what you're concerned about? I'm not listening to this for the rest of my life, Andrew. You make it sound like you're gonna die in pain. Well, aren't we? Well, I'm not. That's gonna be something this guy. So there's got to be something this guy has that we can eat. Ooh, burglary time. He's dead. Shut up. Let's get in there. Throw not front you from the other side of the class. Are you kidding me? Throw a box at it. Got an eye. Oh. Shut the hell up! Eat the corpse. That's a lot of meat, you think to yourself. What? A lot, apparently. Though, I mean, is this still illegal if we didn't kill the guy? It's cannibalism, but of course it's illegal. That is what legal? Well, you know. Oh, you wanna eat him! Isn't that what you were insinuating? Nah, no, I'm just making an observation. Uh, but we can't. If we do eat him, then that's that's it for us. There's no way we wouldn't get caught once they finally let us out. It's not like we killed the guy. I think just messing with the corpse is a crime too. Well, I think they should look past it, given that there's nothing else to eat. Will the staff here admit that they didn't give us food though? And before that, you gotta tell them a demon killed him? Really? That'll fly. Listen, you're overthinking the hell out of this. Are we doing this or not? No. Andrew, I'm expecting an answer. Um, uh, well, yeah. Alright then, let's find something to badger him with. Oh my god. No, God isn't here to save you anymore. While looking at looting the jackets you found, a wallet with 600. Okay, of course. I got a real moral dilemma here. Seeing a dead man's wallet with you. You're there, of course. Dawn, right? You sweetheart. Got Ali, some of mine to treat you some something someday. Maybe. Yay. But what the fish? Ah. The bathroom smells of feces and he feels very intelligent. <laughs> the closet big enough to hide him. That will become useful, I just know it. It isn't really Oh, got a cleaver. Well, I am doing this. So, we got the arms, I'll handle the legs. First, you chop off the cultist's right arm, right now. Next up is the left arm. Yay, we can't carry him out in the open like this. Let's be quick about it. No, you can't get. Can't you get some plastic bags or something? I'll take care of the rest of it in the meanwhile, I guess. I'm counting on you, Andy. Don't call me that. Hand him with the cleave. You hand. What? You need to conceal it before I take it with him. Nope. Oh, wait. Go back. Through here. Across in here. Why else super bishop pass back to our over reform? But they're not carrying me to go by tea and such like that. Wasn't there something? Oh, yeah, it's supply closet or the sup sup supply this. Got some plastic bags. Yeah, I can actually not talk anymore. Like, I'm actually becoming freaking illiterate. Oh, hey, he's dismantled. Got a left arm, right arm, left leg, right leg, right arm, head. No problem presents itself. The plastic bags aren't big enough to fit the full torso in them. Crap, I don't think we can cut through the spine either. Let's follow them over. I, I don't think that's going to work. Watch and learn!
to yeah, see if anything happens to be looking out the window, the, it'll be a disaster. Maybe if I use two bands. Listen, that isn't going. Ta da! Why is he? <laughs> good God, good God, good God! No, don't make me laugh at this. I don't have the power to make you do anything, Andrew. All right, all right, enough. Gather limbs and up and go. There should be plenty enough room. room uh, there should be plenty enough room for them in our freezer. I'll uh, stuff the torso hand in this freezer for now. Then I'll go cook up something while you're at it. Yeah, you'll cook quite the something. Mm -hmm. Why is he so? Oh wait, I was heading to the kitchen. I was just disoriented. But can't I cook? Why won't you? Oh, okay. Best server. Oh, now which one do you want to eat? I'll just go with the left arm. Alright, time to cook. Desi. Desi means you. Press on me. Dinner's ready. A whole arm is. Alright, so what are we having there? Pure deliciousness. What? Eat up. You first. Munch, munch. Oh, what? Oh, you already. Okay. Eat, Andrew. You will not waste this. Um, right. And takes a bite out of you. I don't think he likes it. He begins reaching. No, you don't! <laughs> Swallow. All of it. Oh. Well, well, how is it? It's. God, I hate picky. I made this with love. So you're not leaving the table before you lick the plate clean. Quite, you quit your nagging, woman. You quit your gagging, you big thing. I'll eat it, right? Just give me a minute. You under your watchful eye to see so he finishes plate. Goodbye, I'm so proud of you. Just fuck off, Ashley. What an odd way to say thank you. Yeah, yeah, thanks a bunch. I cleared the table so, we, so leave me alone. We've got a very limited set of spices left, but what, what do you think we should try next? Ugh, I don't know. Maybe pour in there? Alright, I'll try that tomorrow then. I'm off to bed now. Night, night. Yeah, good night. Where am I? Oh, yeah. Bed. Well, see, fully content with your life decisions. Now, well, okay. Said she likes you. Who? A friend from school. Or at least I thought she was a friend. So are you going to be her boyfriend? Gross, I know. Ah, I should teach her a lesson. You're my, you're my brother, mine. I'll make her think twice before staying from another woman. Oh, yeah, you're a girl too. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Haha, <laughs> somehow, somehow you don't count as a lady in my mind. As a person for that matter. Hey, hey, screw you. I'm the worst, most personist lady in the world. So, anyway, I'm gonna take her to the old warehouse and lock her in one of the craters. Crates. Yeah, yeah. Seriously. Mom gave me some money to buy groceries, okay? Focus on it. Let's see if we're sitting there all night. That'll show her. Let's not. Hee <laughs> hee. You should go ask her to hang out. She won't say no then. LA, I don't want to. Just go over and toss her to come with you. Take her to the warehouse and we'll see what happens. Come on. Mom said you help me with anything. I thought she's your friend. Well, I thought she so too. And she can be my friend again afterwards. She just needs a right to remind her how to do it proper. We'll get in trouble. I only let her out when she calls her to tell us. Who and Andy, I guess. Hooray! You're the best. Today's episode is titled Andy and Lively. And the bitch is on the box. One day you'll be a bitch on a box and your friends will make turns pissing on the ground above. What do I do about the, these hussies around you? Where do you learn these words? The bitch is you. I'll take you out to play and when I'm done, it's back in the box with you. I, I really ought to kick your ass one of these days. What is striking you? You wouldn't have forgotten our plans, would he? Why do you look like that? Finally! Oh, what are you doing here? Surprise, I wanna hang out too! Oh. I mean, I guess that's fine. So, hey, you didn't tell your mom you're here? Tell your mom you're here? No, why? Hee <laughs> hee, just wondering. I mean, I'm surprised she let you come hang out with the boy. No way! She thinks I went to study with Julia. But, where are you? Why are you here, actually? Divine intervention. What's that even mean? I mean, she's full of crap. It means she's full of crap. Don't listen. So, are you gonna go inside or what? Is that allowed? I allow it. Let's find a way in right now. I can walk, apparently, for some reason. 
Why'd they nail this metal sphere thing on the wall? It looks like there are dusters are all behind it. Perfect. Tear it open. What? I can't do that. It's okay. I won't tell anyone. As in, literally, I can't do it, dumbass. Not without some tools, at least. Heh. Ha. Even though it's... It's... It, even though it's... this flimsy? Yes. Yeah. I like smart guys that were beefy ones. Who asked? Sledgehammer. Mr. Mallet. I can't really think of a way a mallet would be useful in this situation. I sure can. As in help us get in the warehouse? Okay, yeah, in that case now. Ugh, Lele, I don't want to know what you have in mind. What are you guys talking about? It's nothing, let's keep looking. I think I know. Oh, hey, hammer. Hammer. Got a hammer. You can pick up the nails with that or smash it open. I don't know. In the back of the hammer? Yeah. Yay. <coughs> wow, it just. <coughs> kind of dusty in here. You see, worry about my asthma. It's fine, it's fine. Oh, I know. How about some hide and seek? Ugh, you're such a kid. Huh? And he wants to play too. You do? What? Oh, yeah, sure. See? Well, I mean, it's fun every once in a while. You probably want to play too. You just... I'll be it. I want to count to ten. Hundred. Count to hundred at least. Okay, okay. One, two. Alright, let's find a good glass of shovel. And the alarm is off. Let's just finish this. You still want to do that? Of course. You said no one's. She's here. This is perfect, Lele. You promised. Now hurry up before she's done counting. What are we doing? This is the perfect box. Right here. Oh, now this will do. There isn't any lock on them, but we don't actually want to lock her in. The hell we don't! Lele, it's a stick or something between the rings. That'll keep it closed. Won't the stick just break? No, well, if she's hunched inside, that's that. That she'll have the revelers too. Ready or not, here I come! Oh crap, she's counting too fast. It wasn't that fast, really. Aha, <laughs> let's hide. Hide! Hide in the box? Oh. Where are we hiding exactly? Box. Hunter's flu. Okay. Get okay, everyone closed. What are we supposed to do exactly? Oh. Where do we get a stick anyway? And he picks up whatever wooden debris and is at his feet. I guess this will do. Wheel? What do you think? Is she pretty? The stick? No, what do you think, dumbass? Yeah, she's fine, I guess. Found ya! Both of you. Who's hiding in the same spot? Idiots, uh huh. Who hides? It, I, it was my spot first, and you're it. No way, Andy stole my spot. Yes, yes, I'll go count. Andy goes to count inside. Hey, my hiding spots are the best. I know, a real good one for you. Come take a look. Um, okay. Oh yeah, we gotta just... Real quickly... Um... Someone's at the door. Like, literally, in real life. Think you'll fit in here? Seems like a bad idea. Oh, so... I'm gonna get my clothes dirty. Ooh, boo-hoo, who cares? My mom does. She'll get mad if I... Hundred! Oh shoot, he's coming! Hurry, hurry! Or right, okay. Why is all your friend's hopes inside the crater? Oh, who... Haha, <laughs> what was that? He, I got you now. It's too weak to throw you off the lid. <laughs> is, is, this isn't a, a funny, actually. Let me out. There you are, Andy. He's slow, folks. Hurry up. She's putting up a fight. <laughs> I can't breathe. <laughs> she alright? <laughs> Please, I... Shut up, already, John. I mean, let her out of LA. Just pretending. No one's ever died from some dust. <clears throat> Come on, just let her out. What? You'll believe her over me? not really about whether I believe her or not. Fine, you let her out then. Who cares about me anyway? <coughs> everyone likes her better. Bet you like her better too. But everyone... But, uh, but everyone does. I already know. Why are you... Oh. That's actually pretty sad. <coughs> She's about to die in there. But you'd rather have a girlfriend than spend the time with me? Of course you would. Oh, come on. I already told you. I don't want... And bet... Bet you only hang out with me because mom told you to. Well, that's... Maybe she did, but... It's not fair. Why does everyone like her better? I'm loud and weird and annoying and no one likes me at all. I like you better, Lele. I bet you live a crew bit liar. I knew it. Maybe you'd have more friends if you weren't always so. Not even my brother picks me over. I knew it already. Did I not just say la 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 talk show is cheap? Damn it. <coughs> Ash. <coughs> there you are. Happy now? 
Hey, yes. Just until morning, okay? Yes, yes, you're the best. I like you the best, Andy. Now open it. You hear that? You gotta stay there until the morning. No, please. <coughs> Ashley, let me out, please. <coughs> Ashley, wait, don't <coughs> go. Ashley, please. Ashley! She's gonna die. Ashley? Ashley, are you awake? I am now. Um, okay. What is it? Nothing. I'm just. God, what the fuck did we do? You're still on about dinner? Fine, you starve then. More for me. How are you like this? Are you out of your mind? Listen, I didn't kill the guy, so I didn't do anything wrong. You mutilated him and ate a corpse. What else were you supposed to do? Survival of the fittest. Call the warden and let him know he died? Uh, yes. Um, sir, you summoned a demon and died. I'm sure we didn't do it. Yeah, we wouldn't have to admit we were there. We would have just told him to go check on the guy. Andrew, what the hell? What, what the hell? Didn't we just both agree on this? I could have sworn it was your suggestion in the first place. I was too hungry to think straight, okay? And that's some bullshit. Fine, let's assume it was so. Why do you want me to do about it? I... Whoosh, whoosh, there goes my magic wand. There, I've absolved you of your sins. You never took a bite now. You're welcome. Well, gee, thanks. Let's see how that holds in the face of the law. Listen, who cares? Ugh, isn't this like some extreme sugar sam stuff? Like, we can't be excused, it's the water company's fault. Can we be excused? First, they lock us in for months, and then they won't even feed us. Yeah, the water company should be sued or something. And is cabin fever a real thing? Maybe we can plead insanity? I don't know, Ashley. Ugh, they're in here, they You know, I... I couldn't get this head off. Get his head off. Huh? Like, he didn't fit in the freezer properly. So I needed to chop his head off, off but I couldn't cut it. His spine was too... Anyway, I kind of just... Uh, like, kept cutting around and pulled it off. Like, some plan, I don't know. I keep thinking about it. Ugh, I can't fucking sleep, Ashley. It's... Come here. I don't know what you're wrong with you. How are you so unbothered? I don't know. I compartmentalize. Kind of like we compartmentalize that guy into different freezers. Ashley! Bahaha! <laughs> Andrew, what is it, Andrew? Andrew, Andrew, Andy. Hey! I told you to stop calling me that. We're not kids anymore. Then why are you calling and crying like such a baby? I'm not crying. Wow, 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 the big bad me did the evil thing. You shut your whore mouth. Make me, little bitch. <laughs> Forget this. Hey, Andy, remember when we used to go on adventures? What? And the Atlanta is close for something or another, remember? Why bring this up? Isn't it just a, another one of those? I don't know. Can't you just play along for now? Throughout out this crap situation that we can unpack it all later. Or not, I, I don't know, I will personally. I don't think I will. But you can go to therapy. Like, I couldn't tell a therapist what I've been up to. Alright, just thought. Let's just get out of here. Like, we should have done months ago. Now that you've got food, do you want to keep going into the rest of You've got food. Oh no, I don't. They've thrown us in jail right away. And I don't know which is worse. Withering this coffin or a house or getting railed in prison. Ah, so you want to escape not only this quarantine, but the consequences of reaction as well? Preferably, yeah. This episode's title Andy and Lily and this game. <laughs> oh, the coffin of. I get it. Yeah, whatever. I'm going to sleep now. Good night, sleep tight. I'll try a good night. I love you. Shove that Andy junk up your ass already. My god, I love you that much. Ugh, you make me want to kill myself. Too bad diving down the balcony just too many for you. That hits you in the face, it's hard to see. It's hard to see. <laughs> Your body has absorbed some delicious nutrients. Any flame might eat better today. Okay, what? There's another six stories. I'm waiting there, you die trial back at the cultist lair, Andy. Ah, oh, I knew he'd come around. Though for a moment there, I honestly thought this was going to be a suicide. Well, no matter, let's see what he's up to. Uh, go down. Then we can, I guess, go over here. So, I think... How do we save? Oh. The... Fucking version whatnot? Oh, save. Great! Uh, I did not know you could do that. So, uh, yeah. This game is pretty good. At least for now. Nothing too bad has happened yet. Because I... I am very nervous. Because I feel like the language... And everything else is... <sighs> I just feel like something bad is about to happen. I don't know. I feel nervous. I, I like sense sense of disturbance in the force. 
I mean, have I played any game of cannibalism? No, right? No. No, I haven't. So, this is a bit new. Um, so, yeah. Um, I'll be continuing this. Although, again, no... Uh, no, uh, what was it called? No Lisa Company again, because I need, I need four people, or at least three people, two more people, or three, uh, maximum three, because I cannot, I like keep, because we need someone to monitor, we need someone to help, I cannot, I'm sorry, if it gets, does, it does get, like, a difficulty update, uh, then maybe I will play, but for now, uh, yeah, I guess, that's the video, I, I'm, I'm feeling nervous, and I'm, bye-bye!